about the recipes, it is also about the culture and this is what we are going to highlight in our Asian news channels, Asian food. Asian food is known for its distinctness and this distinctness has come from its rich culture and heritage. Be it Chinese food, be it Japanese, Sri Lankan, seafood or Indian food, it is very very different if we compare it to the rest of the world. We are talking now about the Indian food, which too has its very very specific and distinct qualities and that is what distinguishes Indian food from the rest of not only Asian food but also the world. And there are three major components to start with and these are the culture of sitting and eating food, culture of using hand to eat and the aroma which plays a very very significant role in Indian food. And we have with us Mr. Deepa Parma, the master chef from Kitchen Creations who is going to explain us about these three very very significant part of Indian food. Welcome Mr. Deepa Parma to this program Thank you. Asian Newsmaker, Asian Food. Thank Please you. explain to us why we, we feel that these three components uh, differentiates Indian food from the rest of the world. Now, Indian food as such, as a whole, also is very different from any other Asian food or any food in the world. The most important uh, past part of having Indian food is that we sit down on the floor and fold our legs, uh, and then we have the food. Now this asan is the way we sit, is called in yoga Sukhasan, that we are happy in this asan. And when you sit, uh, there's also a scientific reason behind it. When you sit and eat, your backbone is straight, all right? And when you eat the food, when you are sitting on the floor and eating the food, you bend down to have a bite and you get up, get up, get back. Now that makes the juices in the, in the, in the stomach, no? they release uh, properly and scientifically uh, proven. This is not me who is saying it. This is what it, it is all about, sitting on the floor. And we have a culture of having the food with our hand. Now having food in the hand is very very scientifically proven fact that it is done because of two three main reasons. First you feel the texture of the food, you feel the food in your hand. Second, the food does not get does not burn your mouth because you take, when you touch the food you realize whether it is hot enough to take it in your mouth or not. So the and when you touch the food the brain tells the uh, tells your stomach that yes he is touching the food that means he is about to eat it so the stomach starts releasing the juices accordingly also what is very very important is that traditionally the people the men uh, especially used to be sitting in the kitchen and having the food where the ladies would make the chapatis fresh and serve it to serve them while they are eating in, in the in the kitchen now when eating you in the kitchen and the fresh chapatis are being made or anything for dosa for the matter or any any Indian food for the matter then the aroma that comes out in the in the entire place where you eat in the food is so delicious that it automatically enhances your appetite and makes you feel wanting of more and this is very very specific to the Indian culture so the journey doesn't end here with the digestion and digestive juices only this is just the beginning and we are going to take you to the other aspect of the Indian food as well as the Asian food, which is very, very rich because of its very, very unique culture. Thank you so much. Keep watching us, subscribe us and support us. Asian Newsmakers.